Okay. I just want to make sure I'm in, that I'm recording. Okay. So today is our first week of our 12 weeks of Christmas. Okay. So our video today is going to be using their 12 weeks of Christmas. So if you go to our mini catalog, I'm going to show you what the product we're using today. For week one, I chose to use the very cute Memories and More cards and the envelopes. So if you buy both of these, it's $20, okay? You get 20 card bases and envelopes, and you get a whole pack of Memory and More cards, okay? So I'm going to show you the cards first. So you get six of each of these. So it says, give the gift of Christmas cheer, or you can use the background. This is a background. Um, wishing you the best this season. And then the background is the presents. Then we have let it snow. And again, presents. Then we have may your Christmas be cozy. And there's trees on the back. Then we have good tidings and warm wishes. And then there's a, like this, you could use this as a journaling block or something, write something. Then we have this pattern and then the snowflakes on the back. Okay. So you can use these as four by six picture or four by six, three by four cards in your project life album. Okay. Or I'm going to zoom in just a little bit more. Okay. Let me show you the four by six cards. So for the four by six cards, you get six of these. We have season's greetings and then the bears are on the back. I love this. Then we have Merry Christmas and we have the presents on the back. We have Christmas. Oh, this one's upside down. Sorry. Then we have Christmas is better together. And then we have the snowflakes on the back. So you get three different patterns in the four by six. <clears throat> Sorry. You also get in this bundle you get two sheets of each of these four of these Christmas stickers. Okay. So that is the, this is the memory more cards. So we're going to use these. So let's move on. So then if you buy the card, so if you buy the card kits and envelopes, you get two sets of two, 10 packs of envelopes. So you get 10 of these and 10 of these, and they're already ready for you. Good to go. Then you also get 20 card bases. So this is going to be enough to make 20 Christmas cards. So you get 10 of these and 10 of these. Okay. So today we're going to make 20 Christmas cards using only this product. Okay. So we have our envelopes. We're going to set them to the side. Then we're going to, um, I'm going to start with the blue base card bases and plan them, do a little bit of, okay. So this is card one. They fold let me grab a bone folder real quick. Okay. So this is card number one. And so I'm thinking that we should do this like this and then bring in. So this will be card one. See how quick that these are going to come together. You can use. Um, so another one I like is this. There's card two. Okay. And we're going to see. Let's bring in another. Let's see what else we got here. Wishing you the best season. And then let's move. Let's use one of these presents. And we'll go like this. So I just did the same thing that I did up here, but just flipped it a little. Okay, and let's see where we, let me see the background. So I want to use this bear, and what we'll do is we will take a sticker that said, the sticker that says, tag that says Merry Christmas, and we'll add it to this card when it comes, when we get to finishing the cards, okay? Right now I'm just planning out the 10 cards. So we're doing the 10 blue ones. Um... We have, we did that one. We have the let it snow. So we also have this snowflake pattern. This is one of the four by six cards. So we could just do this and then add this to the front. 
like that. Then some of these I'm saying, let's switch to red card bases. I'm playing out a few red ones now. Okay, so we have, we're going to do our presents and our, let's try that one. Then let's go to another red one. And let's see, we have this. And then... So we have this one, and I'm going to do this one actually on both. Okay, so we're going to bring that in and do it on both car both colors. Okay, so we're making progress. And you can make more than one of the same. So we have, may your Christmas be cozy. Let's see what we can find to go with this. Okay. So we have, oh, look, we have this. We can do that. The red plaid and the green goat Christmas colors great together. So we have, let's see, two, four, six. Let's do another red one. Um, let's see. We have, okay, so let's pause with the designing. Let's put these ones together, and then we'll come back and do the others. This is just supposed to show you how we can mass produce Christmas cards. If you buy the, why is this not going? Let's grab another one. Um, I'm not having very good luck. There we go. I was gonna say I'm not having very good luck today. So um, if you buy these two products, it's twenty dollars for the two, and then you have adhesive, then you're good to go. This card. It's simple just like this and it's done or you can add on the embellishment this is the adhesive back glitter sequence that goes with this suite and you can add these on which we might at the end we'll see so so this one I'm just taking a 4 by 6 card putting it on the front of the red card base okay and then we're going to bring in, I'm going to bring in this little um, bear with the Christmas tree and put it down there and embellish that up perfectly. Okay, so next we're going to do, there is, so you can just purchase the cards and the envelopes and mass produce these cards just using what is in the two, or you can... I'm gonna. Uh, I'm looking. For, I want to do this big old polar bear from the stickers. This is a suite of products. So there's ribbon. There's um. So there's ribbon that you can get. You can get the stamp set and the punch that goes with this, which is amazing. Okay, so we're going to go on the right hand side with the 3x4 and then we're going to layer this one over it. Okay, just like that. And we're doing the opposite on this one. Okay, so we're going to start with our blue plaid on this side. And then we're going to attach our card, our 3x4 card. So you can see these are going together really smoothly, really quick, easy cards. Um, it's a great way to get your Christmas card. If you only send a few Christmas cards, it's a great way to get your Christmas cards out in the mail fast. Um, okay, so then we're going to do this one. Just like that. And then I'm going to put warm wishes on this one. And let's go ahead and put the Christmas trees like right there. See how fast these are coming together? And you could have, like you could sit down and watch a football game or watch a movie on the one of the Hallmark, oh I did that backwards. Hold on. Just give me a second to find the one I, I know I have more of them. There we go. I just did the here we 
go. Much better. Okay. And then I love these polar bears. They are so beautiful. And we are going to stand, put warm wishes. Okay. So those are from the sticker sheets that come with the memory more cards. I'm going to have to order a second patch of these. And if you wanted, if you need 40 cards, you could do two of these. Okay. Totally up to you what you would wish to do. Let's see. So far we've got, let me show you the cards we've made so far. So we have two and, um, these are all be on my blog today for the 12 weeks of Christmas. We have that one and we have these two. So we have two, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. We've created ten cards in just a little bit of time. And then you have ten more card bases that you can create using the same. So let's see if we can bring in my card rest of my card bases to fold them. And like I said, this is all I'm using to create these cards today is the product from the two the cards and envelopes. So they already come pre-scored for you. They're white on the inside. Um, you can, like I said, you're more than welcome to purchase um, the whole suite and then you could make multiple cards. If you don't want to buy the cards and envelopes, you can buy basic white envelopes and basic white cardstock and make it go further. Your product go even this, these memory more cards and stuff go further. Um, totally up to you what you want to do. Okay. So we're going to do a red one. Let's see. I want to use this. What if we did, let me see. I don't want to mess my card up. So we'll do this and then we'll have this card coming. So we're just going to set it down at an angle and then we'll add this one. And there's another one done. We got a blue one. Let's see if we can do blue the same way. I'm looking forward to using these for my project life for December. I love the winter months. These will be so cute in a project life. If you're doing December daily, this would be really cute for that too. So we have let it snow. Let me see. Do we have snowflakes? Okay. So we are going to do, I'm just going to simply put let it snow and I'm going to come in. This is a, I'm going to put this down first. This is one of the stickers and then I'm just going to bring the card like that. Okay. Let's do a red one like that. Let's bring in the green. Okay. And let's bring in the wishing you the best this season. Perfect. Okay. We are just coming right along. Um, so let's trim this card a little bit. So I'm going to trim the, just the blue is what I want. Okay. And then we'll save these cause we can use them. Nothing to go to waste. And then I want to use, um, where is it? Let's see. We can do this one. I don't think I've used this season's greetings yet. We'll do that next. And then we're just going to take this Merry Christmas. You can pop this up with dimensionals if you want. You don't have to. Okay, so let's go ahead and do the season's greetings. Okay. And on our sticker sheet is a couple stars. Okay. So I'm just going to take three of them and put them on this one. Okay. So let's grab a red card and 
let's do let's do may your Christmas be bright and cozy and we are going to bring in this Christmas tree and then I'm going to bring in the blue tree and the small deer see how quick that comes together and it's a cute card okay another red one Let's use some more of our stickers. Give the gift of Christmas cheer. And then we're going to put this little seal down there. Let me grab this. Wait, let's take one of these. Since we already have it cut, we'll make it like this. And then I tried not to push my seal down yet because I want to put this under a little bit like that. Isn't that cool? Yeah, so that's that one. We have two more cards left. We're doing great. Um, we still have lots to play with. So we could do this where we have the journaling block. And then we could create our scene inside the journaling block with our polar bears like that. Okay, and I like it better on the blue, but let's grab a, hmm. let's grab one of these. This is a four by six card, a snowflake card. I'm just going to cut it at three by four and then I can use it on other parts. Okay, so we'll just put that to the side. We're going to do our snowflake like this. Then we'll do our this snowflake like this, okay? And we'll do Christmas is better together. We have one more card base. Let's see what we can come up with. Um, let's see. I believe we could do this. This would probably be better on blue, but or on, yeah, on the blue card base. So let's do, we could do the gift of Christmas. Okay, so we are gonna do this here. It's another one of our strips. I'm gonna do the gifts of Christmas. Give the gift of Christmas cheer. And then let's see, let's do some presents stacked over here okay let's see we have more presents somewhere and then we'll just add okay you can use all of the you don't have to use as many as I am totally up to you okay so let me show you these ten We'll do a flip through of all 20 cards. Um, and then we'll go back and I'll show you what we have left. So this is one. And then I'm just going to flip through the 20 cards that we've made on the video. Okay. So these will be on my blog today with a... Um, so you can see them. When you see this video, it there's a vid, the video and then there'll be, um, sorry, I'm looking at the cards. <laughs> um, then they'll cut the pictures and everything. There's a blog post to go with it. Okay. So that is our 20 cards. So we have 20 cards ready to send with envelopes and let me show you what we have left. So sticker wise, we still have quite a few stickers that we can use on like this, let it snow. You could use that to seal your envelope if you wanted. It's totally up to you. Okay, so we have one, two, three of these. I kind of made a mess over here, so just bear with me while I'm pulling them in. Okay, and then these are the three by four cards we have left. Okay. And then remember we have this one that I cut. It's a three by four piece. So these are the three by fours we have left. And then the four by sixes, we have three of these. We have three of these. 
two of these and then these are the two that I cut down. So there's still quite a bit left that you could make more cards with or using your project life or whatever you choose. Okay. And like I said, there's still plenty of stickers and we have the envelopes and then there are 20 cards. So I will take pictures. There, I will have taken pictures of these and have a blog post for you. And I hope you enjoyed our first week of Christmas. Check back next week for another tw uh, week two of Twelve Weeks of Christmas, where we're going to be using one of our Christmas kits um, from the kit collection to create cards, Christmas cards. Okay. So come back next week, and we'll see you then. Thank you.